In this video, we'll take a look at whether KMnO4 is acetic, basic, or neutral when it's dissolved in water. This is potassium permanganate. So to figure out whether this potassium permanganate will be an acid, base, or neutral in water, we need to look at the neutralization reaction that produces it. So this is our reaction. We have HMnO4 plus KOH, an acid and a base. They neutralize to form our salt plus water neutralization reaction. So we know our reaction. Now we can use these rules. And we have to figure out the strength of the acid and the base. This table here can help us. It's a good table to memorize. If we look at the table, we'll see HMnO4. It's not listed as a strong acid, but it's not listed as a weak acid either. It's a little bit obscure, and I would hope that you would be told on a test or a quiz whether this was a strong acid or base. So. It's not listed, but it turns out this actually is a strong acid. So we'll write SA to remember that. KOH, one you should know. Potassium hydroxide, that's a strong base. So we're going to write SB above that. So we know the strength of the acid and the base. Looking at our rules, we can see we have a strong acid and a strong base. Strong base, strong acid. Yep, that's it. So this is the rule. According to this rule here, our strong acid and our strong base, when we mix them together, they neutralize. The resulting salt will have a pH that is neutral. It'll be 7 when it's dissolved in water. So in answer to our question, KMnO4, when it's dissolved in water, it will be neutral. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.